My sister calls me up. We live in Spokane. She calls me up and she says, Hey, boys kind of want to come up and see you. Be all right. They come up for, you know, a week or so, whatever. I said, Yeah, we'll be fine. I had these, pe the, these, these gnarly fake teeth. <laughs> Just gnarly as shit fake teeth. They were, they were so gross. It was unbelievable, so I put them in, right? I put the fake teeth in. <laughs> so they come off the plane, they see me, they wave. I wave back at them. Look at my mouth closed, wave back at them. I walk over to them and I smile. Chris just looks at me, Keith looks at me and look, goes back like this. And I said, oh, I, I, I pretend I didn't notice anything, right? That everything was fine. So I left the bin. Uh, you guys got your fishing stuff. Do you need to stop by uh, a sporting good place and, and pick anything up? And and Keith said, Chris says, yeah, I, I need to get a couple of things. Are you all right, Uncle JP? You okay? <laughs> I said, yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. Why do you ask? He said, oh, no, no reason. You go to the freaking store. sporting goods store? Go to the store. <laughs> <laughs> I have these <laughs> bags in my mouth. <laughs> We go to the store. I can't believe it. I can't. Jesus, the guy doesn't brush his teeth. Doesn't do nothing. <laughs> you know. So I am Mosey. I'm back to him. You know. How you guys doing? You know. <laughs> <laughs> this sort of thing. I <laughs> we we finally uh, get what he needs, what they need, and I said to him, They got some extra toothbrushes. Yeah, and so <laughs> I said, the more I think about this, the more hilarious and. <laughs> up I was <laughs> with these kids. They were there for like two weeks. We had two fight nights. I like how dad comes up with things. He goes like, let's do fight night. Yeah. Like everybody does fight night. Like it's yeah. a thing. So we're down there and uh, we put on the gloves and we start boxing, you know, we're doing all this stuff and we're wrestling around and we're, we're, we're really having a good time. And then uh, uh, Chris says, Uncle, Uncle JP, you're hitting me too hard. I said, I'm barely touching you, you wimp. So I go upstairs and I get a pillow. Put the bed pillow on his chest. And I take two belts. I put one here and I put one here. And I wrap it around. And I have this bed pillow on him. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I can hit him. <laughs> so you, so they beat the crap out of him. Pulled the punches. He's just like, I'm just going to keep hitting him hard. So this kid can take it. I'm, hit, I'm hitting him with the thing. Keith's on the side, commentary on the whole thing, you know. Love the... I had to work out with Chris because Chris was aggressive. He was like a little pit bull. Chris and I used to get into it and beat each other up all the time. It was, it was a lot of fun. Yeah, we did another thing. There was a pile of like gravel. Well, I know it was a big pile of it. It was a reserve. But it was real close to this, this pine tree that you can actually climb up. So I said, guys, you know, when I was little, when I was your age, I used to climb up uh, tractors. And, and stuff like that that was left on the side. We jump off them into piles of gravel. It says it's a lot of fun. Keith climbs the tree. He's up there, and Keith says, "I don't know if I want to do this." So Chris starts calling him a pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Keith is wary of it. I said, "Keith, if if you don't want to do it, it's it's okay. You come on down. We don't have to do it." No, 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 no. I I gotta do this. I gotta do this. Okay. He goes to jump, and the branch that he's on breaks. Branch he's on breaks. He grabs a hold of the branch as he as he comes off it, and it doesn't it doesn't break all the way off. It's one of those it's like green breaks, yeah. you know. And he's swinging on this branch up oh there, right? God. Swinging back and forth on his branch, and just when we think that he's going to stop, he does stop by slamming himself into the trunk of the tree. After we did the fights, we would go out and we would go down the hill and we, we had the boat moored and we would go out there and we'd get on the boat and I'd take the boat out and I said, okay guys, it's time for some PT. We're gonna play Viking PT. Okay, what's that? I said, well, here's how it works. I sit on the bow of the boat, I'm gonna drink a beer, you guys are going to be in the water and you're going to hold the tow rope in your teeth and you're going to swim 
and you could, you could pull, the, pull the boat. What the heck, Dad? Dude, aren't you the one who's always like, don't open, don't uh, break tape, uh, electrical tape with your teeth, Adam? He's gonna make them freaking tow the boat with their teeth. <laughs> you a hole! I'm gonna drink, I'm gonna drink the beer and tow the boat with your teeth. So I, so I looped, uh, I looped the rope around so it was almost like a noose. <laughs> oh my god! And it, it, it fit over him this way, you know, and it had her, had her teeth like a, like it was uh, oh the god. horse thing, whatever you call that, like bridle, a bit, a bridle, a bit. Yeah, they had it like that, and they were they were doing a breath stroke and they were swimming, swimming, and they and they would say they would stop and say, "We're getting tired. How much further we gotta go?" And I says, ah, "I got about a third of a can left." I says, "You guys gotta go until this is done." <laughs> that might be child abuse. I don't it probably know, was. <laughs> they loved it though. They have a, oh, they loved it. They did. They they, they bite this it. rope, they, boys. They, it's they your Uncle John. I gotta well, drink this beer. When we went to do it the second time, they were they're fine. <laughs> <laughs> so the two weeks is up. We had a great time. The only thing that that pissed off mom was Chris was doing something and he my mom yeah, yeah did something and he knocked over a plant and he broke he broke some pot that Carol had and she was mad at him. He wanted to go home that day because, because Carol got mad at him. My sister says, "How did it go?" Oh my God. <laughs> so really they imagine. recounted what happened. <laughs> Phone rings. Oh gosh. It's my sister. And she goes, Hey, she says, I talked to the boys. What the hell were you trying to do? Kill them? <laughs> <laughs>